guys, it's me Gina and welcome back to my kitchen. In case this is the first time you're stopping by, I'm a wife and mother from the Midwest and I like to cook meals for my family and sometimes I videotape the recipes and I post them here on YouTube. So, this is an impromptu video and I am making an experimental recipe. So, you guys are going to be along for the ride and we're going to see if this is good or not. Um, I'm trying to make my own version of like a salsa de mocajete, which is like a roasted tomatillo salsa um, that is like a chunkier texture um, than like a blended cooked salsa. So this is what I happen to have on hand. I'm sorry I don't have all the ingredients lined up, but this is most of it. So um, I happen to have five tomatillos, so I just peeled them um, and washed them. And I mean, these have been in the fridge for like a week, so there's some brown spots, but ain't no thing. Um, I'm going to be using three jalapenos a slice of onion and then two cloves of garlic and then I have my broiler set to high so I'm going to go ahead and spray this with some olive oil spray um, give it a little sprinkle of salt and then throw it in the oven until everything is nice and charred and I will probably flip everything um, halfway through so be right back okay so these are our finished chiles and tomatillos they are nice and roasty and toasty um, as you can see the skin is blackened they're soft to the touch um, and they're just pretty much ready so I actually pulled out the um, garlic uh, when I flipped them the first time because the garlic was looking pretty golden and you don't want to have burnt garlic or else it will be bitter so I'm gonna go ahead and actually toss these back in these are something else these are called chiles hueros, um and they're like banana peppers I think and I stuffed them with cheese and we just kind of are going to eat them as an appetizer so I'm going to toss them back in um I don't know why I turned off the broiler um so give me a second I'm going to go ahead um and toss all of these into this bowl and then we're going to hit it with the hand blender before we add in some cilantro and some nor suiza Okay, so I pulsed it with the hand blender maybe like five or six times because you want this chunky consistency, which I might end up adding a little bit of water to since we're going to be eating this with tacos and not, um, sorry, crap is everywhere today, and not uh, for like chips and salsa type of consistency, so it is a little bit on the thicker side, but you want it to be nice and chunky like this because that way it's like kind of reminiscent of the whole mocojete, which is like... I don't know what it's made out of, like lava rock maybe, a bowl, and it's got like a, it's a mortar and pestle basically, and like they grind it by hand, so to season it, I'm going to start off with a teaspoon of Nor Suiza, and if you don't know what that is, it's this, it's the Nor Chicken Bouillon Powder, and then our cilantro, since we didn't blend it in there, um, go ahead and chop it by hand, so I'm going to start off with this size of a pinch, and see how that goes. And we might also add some regular salt and some black pepper. You could also add some chopped fresh onion to it if you wanted. Um, it's already got the roasted onion in it. And I'm going to taste it and see what I think about that. Oh man, that's really good. Needs a little bit more salt, so because the Nor Suiza is out, I'm going to do another half of a teaspoon about. Toss it in there. And I don't think it needs black pepper, actually. But I am going to add a little bit of chopped fresh onion to it, which I already have chopped up because we are having tacos. Hi. What are you doing? You're sitting? Sorry, I'm making a bunch of stuff. That's why my countertop is all crazy. So this is just minced white onion. I'm going to add about the size amount of a handful. That looks good. Hey, Daniel. Can you come and try my salsa I just invented? I'm videotaping. I want them to see in real life I made a video of a recipe I just invented. Let's find his chips. Mm -hmm. 
Daniel, can you come try it? Hang on, I gotta open these chips for him. Mm, looks so good. I tried to make it like mocojete salsa. It like I roasted everything. Mexican husband challenge. You like it? Delicious. That's what I was going for. Do you want me to add water to it for our tacos? Perfect. Perfect. Delicious. Good job. All right. All right, guys. So that is my first on the fly. Let's invent a recipe with Gina video. If you enjoyed it, I sincerely appreciate it if you could give it a thumbs up or consider subscribing for more awesome content. Um, I'm going to go ahead and throw up a couple of links here so you can check out some of my other videos. And that's it. Thanks. Have a great day.